Now the pandemic continues to impact the community. Earlier today, Calvary Cemetery in Youngstown hosted a COVID-19 memorial prayer service, honoring those lost during the pandemic and those fighting it on the front lines. First News reporter Samantha Bender spoke with those who have been affected personally by COVID. December of last year, I lost my grandma due to COVID. Um, Mary Rush, she's buried here at Calvary. Through tears, Rachel Nuzo shared with me the gaping hole that COVID has left her with. Jenna Shemlick tells me she too knows the feeling all too well. She also lost her grandmother to COVID last year. We weren't allowed to go see her in the hospital. We weren't allowed to be with her. So she passed away alone and we couldn't really hold any like service for her. The memorial prayer service today allowed families a chance to come together and support each other. It gave them a chance to properly lay their loved ones to rest, something that many unfortunately couldn't do throughout the pandemic. I just want families to receive some closure and hope for the future that it is going to be okay and to see that their loved one is laid to rest here and we're taking care of them. Bishop David Bonner of the Diocese of Youngstown led the ceremony. I know there's a part of us that just would like to forget that this ever happened, but we can never forget the fact that so many lives were lost. Bishop Bonner tells me we also can't forget the many sacrifices that have been made by frontline workers. To honor them, there was a wreath laying ceremony for first responders, safety personnel, and essential workers. The wreaths will be laid in front of a COVID-19 memorial bench that will be permanently placed in Calvary Cemetery, serving as a reminder of those lost during the pandemic. We move on, but we never forget. We never forget what we lost and who we lost. Reporting in Youngstown, Samantha Bender, WKBN 27 First News.